हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू द स्टीरियो केमिस्ट्री लेक्चर अगेन इन कंटिन्यूएशन टू द लास्ट लेक्चर ऑफ कंफर्मेशन ऑफ इथेन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस टू स्टेबल कंफर्मेशन ऑफ वन टू डाइफ्लोरो इथेन दीज टू स्टेबल कंफर्मेशन आर गॉश एंड स्टेगर्ड this is an interesting example where gauss conformation has been found to be more stable than staggered in gaseous as well as in solution stage in more polar solvents gauss conformation is even more strongly preferred there are two interactions that disfavor gauss conformation first wanderwall's repulsion but this is very small because of a smaller size of fluorine atom the second interaction is a strong dipole dipole repulsive interaction if we see the orientation of cf dipoles in gauss and staggered conformation we will find that there is a strong dipole dipole repulsion in gauss conformation despite this strong dipole dipole repulsive interaction gauss form is more stable than staggered the high stability of gauss form can be explained in terms of these two hyperconjugative interaction which are triggered by very high electronegativity of the fluorine atom this hyperconjugative interaction is optimal when f ccf dihedral angle is 90 degrees due to this reason plus a small historic reason the actual f ccf dihedral angle becomes 71 degrees an alternative explanation of the preferred gauss conformation is in terms of stabilizing interaction between the field ch sigma bonding orbital on one carbon and the empty cf sigma star anti bonding orbital on the other carbon which is greatest when the two orbitals are exactly parallel this only happens in gauss conformation this is called gauss effect to understand this stabilizing interaction let's make flying wedge formula of gauss conformation of 1 to difluoroethane this is the filled ch sigma bonding orbital on the left carbon this is the empty cf sigma star anti bonding orbital on the right carbon and this is the stabilizing interaction between the filled ch sigma bonding orbital and the empty cf sigma star and tie bonding orbital there is one more such interaction between the ch sigma bonding orbital on the right carbon and the empty cf sigma star and tie bonding orbital on the left carbon because of very high electronegativity of the fluorine atom this is stabilizing interaction dominates over the destabilizing interactions and thus making gauss conformation of 1 to difluoroethane more stable than the staggered conformation 